Well, the International Organization for Migration, or the IOM, in partnership with its nonprofit partners, distributed 160 electronic tablets to primary schools and other organizations in the month of February. This handover to the Office of Law Enforcement Policy, Ministry of National Security, primary schools and non-governmental organizations was part of an initiative to narrow the digital learning gap created by the COVID-19 pandemic. Speaking at the handover ceremony, Director of the Office of Law Enforcement Policy, Gail Charles, took the opportunity to thank the IOM for their donation of the devices and spoke of their importance to further learning and education. If our nation fails to educate any portion of the society, the entire society will suffer as a result. So education is vitally important in the socio-economic uh, upliftment of our society. Well, since Trinidad and Tobago recorded its first confirmed case of the coronavirus, the IOM has been working with the government and other stakeholders to combat the impact of the pandemic on vulnerable groups such as migrants. IOM head of office in Port of Spain, Jewel Ali, explained that this initiative is part of the IOM's global strategic plan to adapt to the changing needs that communities of concern are facing due to COVID-19. We would have partnered with the AMMR and therefore we donated tablets for Venezuelan primary school children and then we would have partnered with TTV Solnet who is actually providing online education for Venezuelan children. And we would have provided tablets to them also, as well as tablets to some schools in rural Trinidad and Tobago, such as Moruga.